Recall that a motor turns electricity into mechanical energy. A motor can be used to turn a belt, fan, and many other objects. There are two types of motors, single phase, and three phase. For this module, we will focus on wiring a single phase motor. There are many types of motors, but each of them has a start winding, run winding, and start capacitor. Some motors will also have a run capacitor. Recall that factory wiring is done by the manufacturer of the product. A motor will have five wires installed by the manufacturer. The motor will have a ground wire, two wires for the run capacitor, line wire, and common wire. Each of these wires needs to be connected to the correct component. We will reference the wiring diagram to determine the connections. Let us look at a concrete example. We will walk through wiring the outdoor fan motor, OFM, in an HVAC unit. The OFM has been highlighted in the schematic diagram to the right. The hot wire goes from terminal 21 of the contactor to the motor. You will use a wire nut to connect the two hot wires. This connection has been highlighted in the diagram. The neutral wire goes from the OFM to L2. These two wires will be connected with a wire nut. This connection has been highlighted in the image to the right. Next, we will connect the brown wire from the motor to the F terminal on the capacitor. We will use a crimp on connector for this. The connection has been highlighted in the image. Finally, we must connect the green wire to ground. You can see the ground symbol in the schematic to the right. The OFM for an HVAC unit has now been wired. In this module, you learned how to wire a switch, capacitor, and single phase motor.